All right, so this is our review for Dirty Neighbors. We got this game for free uh, to do an Amazon review for it. Uh, we're going to open it up, talk a little bit about how it's played, and then we're going to play around and let you all see, okay? Uh, again, like I said, we got this for free, but on Amazon, this is actually $25. It comes with 270 cards, which is uh, 250 dirty cards and 20 neighborhood watch cards, and then there's two little stack of uh, answer sheets in there. <clears throat> and these are kind of like post-it notes that you write on. You're going to see that when we open it up, okay? This plays 4 to 10 people, uh, and the game is rated for 17 and up. Um, I went through some of the cards. I saw why there's some pretty adult cards in there. So we actually filtered out some of the more adult stuff and, and got the cleaner cards that we can do for this Amazon review, okay? We didn't want to say anything. We'd be embarrassed to say in church. <laughs> so, so I'm going to open the box up, let you see the contents. You got the rule booklet, which we'll talk about here in a minute. Then you have the question cards, the answer sheets, which look like this. And guys, this will go ahead and start getting this on. <clears throat> and then you have the neighborhood watch cards back here in the back, which are actually penalties against the other players in the table. You can fill, you can shuffle those into the question cards later, or you know whenever you want. Now we, uh, the rules are pretty simple. Uh, the first person will get one of the question cards, they'll read it off, and it will be addressed to the player either on their left or right. The other players will then write down the best answer for that player, hand them back to Cody or whoever whoever's reading at the time. He will read those answers out and then decide which answer he likes the best. Whoever wrote the winning answer will get that card as a point. Now, according to this, the first person to five points wins, but, I mean, you could really go infinitely if you really wanted to and, and, and play for hours. The play time for this is saying 30 to 90 minutes, uh, but we'll, the one we're doing right now is just going to be a couple minutes to give you an idea how it works, okay? So what Tim has done with the uh, rule book here is instead of making a whole bunch of rules and uh, literature that you got to read through that's kind of dry as a bone, he's made a little story out of the rules section here. Now, the majority of it is things that you're going to figure out just from being human, uh, and most of that's going to happen naturally as you start your game night or party or whatever. But the section that you really want to kind of pay attention to are the rules here, which we talked about a moment ago. Uh, customized to maximum laugh probability just talks about how you can shuffle in the neighborhood watch cards, uh, let the crowd vote. It's just little variations of the rules that you can uh, play off of to go forward, okay? Sir. Okay. Great. So do, do I, I get to write one about Okay, myself? so here's one of the neighborhood watch yeah. cards. It says the players player to your right. It's gonna be Jess. Only talked about politics the entire party, so she loses one card. But she doesn't have any cards yet, so we're just gonna give her that as a penalty. There yeah. you go. Player second to your right. <laughs> Paul again. <laughs> started to blank to kill some time. <laughs> Paul started to lick the walls to kill some time. <laughs> started to thumb wrestle with himself <laughs> to kill some thumb. beat box and break dance to kill some time you've been known to do that sometimes. you have yeah. and twerk to kill some time <laughs> I'm going to go with a thumb wrestle. That was me. That was a good one. That was good. Yeah. This is going to be now? Uh, if we were allowed to cut loose and say whatever we wanted to say, it'd been a lot more fun, but, you know, that's, uh, we got to play by the rules in order to not break the ears and eyeballs of kitties on the internet. Um, <laughs> I'm going to have to give it a five. What do y'all think? Yeah, yeah. definitely. Like it. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty a good five out of five. Yes. This is a one to five scale. <laughs> Got it? All right. All right. I would give it a 17 out of a possible 650. Think so? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You've got it. It's official. Is it over 9? It's over 9. It's a brown out of 10. <laughs> Let's not put All right. in the All right, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs>